I, we, we heard it just the, 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 the vitriol. Yeah. Uh, okay. Targeted at, 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 at Kevin. Oh, come on. I, I was a little surprised to yeah. see Calvin extend yeah. the hand after such a, a deeply personal matchup, yeah. but no. Was, He's just clearing the ring. Yeah, I was waiting for it too, baby. That, that's dirty but right Kevin, there. Who's trying to get back yeah, in there? Who's not going to take that? That's, that's a personal. That's Rick, not disrespectful. Ringside security will be coming back. This is another level for, like I said, it, it's this. Uh, Listen, Ted, uh, moments ago, Kevin Koo was, uh, it was, he was ragged up. Yeah. Tankman had a hard time lifting him up for that. The Tankman driver, because he was just dead weight. When we see it here at Limit Break, man, he, everybody has been pushed to their limit. Their characteristics are coming out. The frustration because it's the last straw on the camel's back. Attitude-wise, frustration-wise, performance-wise. It shows that people here at Deadlock Pro are giving everything they have. Kind of makes me wonder whether or not Kevin Koo kind of realized what had happened. So, you know, you get your belt yeah. wrong, sometimes you just start swinging. No, I think Koo is disrespected. What, what is this? One half of the Motor City Machine Gun. Oh, he's got something to say, too. I got to hear this. Cut my fucking music. Brother, I'm off the clock right now. So are you. If you think I'm fighting you for free, you're not fucking thinking hard enough. The fact of the matter is, I fucking love this company. Independent pro wrestling, that's the lifeblood of this industry. All of you are the beating heart. And they deserve a lot better than you acting like a fucking asshole. Oh. Charlie's checking the disrespect of the champion. The veteran putting the champion in place. To be totally honest with you, and you know this, you know this deep down, I think you're fucking awesome. I think you have all the talent in the world. I think pro wrestling going forward, the next five, ten years, it's going to be whatever you want it to be. But I think on June 16th in Chicago, you're going to have to fucking go through me. I'm not going to tell a lie. I don't know how much longer I'm going to be on the independence, but I want to go out with a bang. I want that belt. It's up to you to accept my challenge. Listen, you can call me an asshole all you want. The one thing I've done since I've had this belt is accept any and all challenges. But the thing is, it ain't just a challenge for me. It's going to be a challenge for you. Because I understand you want this belt, but a lot of motherfuckers in the back want this belt. But when you step in this room with me, you got to want it more than me. When I say by any means, I truly mean by any means. So in Chicago, bring your A game. Because if not, it might be your last match, not your last match on the Indies. Wow. Oh, man. Chicago to defend that championship against Alex Shelley. Let me, wow. tell, you, let me tell you something, baby, right here. You, we saw the game plan that Kevin Koo came in with working on the leg of the champion, and it worked almost to a T, almost to a victory. Nobody can take you apart like Alex yeah. Shelley. Excellent point. I'll tell you what, I, I, Caprici nailed it. If there's somebody that can knock Calvin Tankman off the throne, it's going to be somebody like Shelley. But we are out of time. We will see you June the 16th in Chicago. Tickets available right now at dpwtix.com. For all of us, for Caprice, for Vader, for James, John, and all of us here at DPW, I'm Rich Bokini saying so long from Durham. We'll see you in the Windy City. Good night, everyone.